Yo, YouTube, what's up? It's your boy, the Thuggy Thugster. I'm back again. So now we got the second video of the day. This one is show you how to update your brand attribute, right? So the brand attributes are the ones that you see on the screen around the, the wheel that you some affect each other. Now, one thing is this, if you pay attention to them, they're across from each other. Look at NBA, look at street. The more street you, more street ball you play, the more street points you get and the less NBA points you get. So it goes the opposite way. Now, if you see at mine, music and fashion, they fight each other. That's because, but I'm sorry, they fight each other. But the reason I got both high is because I've been doing both of them. So even though they do fight each other, if you do both at the same time, they do level up. So as you can see, I'm more team oriented than solo because I started answering more team questions to get my chemistry, especially when I got trained. Now, with that being said, if you want to know how to level up some of the tougher ones like fundamentals and corporate, which you see my fundamentals is at a five and my corporate is at a six. And I know a lot of people, they're trying to get their record label. They're trying to get their fashion label, right? Um, and on one on both of them when you're trying to get your deal you have to, to in order to get the investment from the ladies that's going to invest into you um you have to both level up your corporate wherever it may be one level right now um to get the corporate up for sure and we'll focus on fundamentals in a moment to get the corporate up it's all about look for me the easiest way if you want to just go one level now if you want to keep doing this you're going to ruin you are going to ruin hold on you're going to if you want to do your corporate you're going to ruin your free spirit so you don't want to destroy your free spirit because you need that high as well you kind of want all of them high because they all tie into like these endorsements and stuff because i know me myself personally i need this uh, Gatorade endorsement so I need level seven fundamentals and right now I'm level five so I, get, I gotta get my fundamentals up so this tutorial you're gonna help me as well you did let's go so um to get your corporate up the easiest way that I find and again it'll destroy be careful with this because if you overdo it it'll destroy let me go to where I'm trying to get to animations and runway animations so go to animations go to runway animations the ones that I know for sure that work understated elegance and the thespy if you have these now how i acquired them i'm sorry i forgot i've been doing quest okay the quest that a lot of the fashion quests and even some of the other ones that have runway turns and runway walks don't ignore them do those and you will get these unlocked they, you may already have them so the thespian and understated elegance now these are not the only two, but however, what you want to do is use ones that are not flashy. You want to use regular type movements and just boring stuff is what I can say. Because it's corporate, right? It's boring and your clothes don't matter. I thought you had to have a certain outfit on. So I'm going to show you clothes don't matter. So, okay. So I had to cut because I was in the way. So as you see, I moved to the other side. So let's try this again. So understated elegance elegance i'm from the south <laughs> and the thespian uh picked those so you see free spirit went down 15 corporate goes up 25 and you get plus 10 on the fashion you're always gonna get some extra on the fashion now you see it's relatively boring movement movement is not flashy i'm gonna show you the opposite free spirit negative corporate went up you get points for the walk and points for the turn both are important if you pick the opposite they fight each other and it it is counterproductive so you have to pick pick two boring ones if you want the corporate and if you want your free spirit you do the exact opposite the clothes don't matter so let's go b-boy shuffle and let's go the robot you know so he out here he dancing you know what i'm saying he jigging yeah it is. free spirit goes up corporate goes down bing now corporate only went down a little bit that's what's up now you're doing the robot hey jig with it long little nip c hey you know what i'm saying free spirit go up corporate go down hey jig on them they go crazy just like that okay now for the fundamentals part are you ready you thought it was boring for the corporate fundamentals are so boring okay now if you play my career if you grind your player your badges that's essentially the best way that I know to get your fundamentals up, okay? Now, so check it out, man. It's so boring, bro. I'm gonna get straight to the point. 
you literally have to once you play my career bro if you see plus 25 on fundamentals plus 25 on fundamentals you have to do these type of things now there is other ways and it still revolves around playing my career or doing interviews now do you, you know how the interviews pop up and they have you to go to the place like to the um i don't know where they're all at but it's like different um things you have to do um like your agent there's interview people newspaper people uh all kind of like people that interview you and stuff like that right so basically when they ask you questions you have to answer the question in a way that is all about basketball so if it's like if the, if, if the answers if the two answers the two interview answers are one of the answers is about you being the best ever or you being a team oriented player pick the team oriented player you get points for fundamentals okay that's one again well that's the other one so well that's one part of the interview also the same thing can happen in a regular interview with the regular in any one of them so if it's if it's an after the game interview or if it's the post conference interview because you know you have both um and if it's one of the ones where you're going to visit the reporters directly and have a in-person interview make sure you answer the question that's team oriented because you get points for fundamentals so that's one way again it's the interview answer team oriented for boring answers not like yo i'm the man which normally i want to pick on the man because i'm kind of flashy with it you know but make sure you do that if you're trying to raise your fundamentals another thing is do the development coaches or even the other ones like the coach drills a lot of them are the coach drills so if you do these little development coach drills again they all lean around the nba so you do those you get plus 25 on each one so you go up 100 you do four and that's 100 fundamental points so hopefully that helped if you like the video definitely hit like hopefully that helped other than that if you guys have any more questions about anything leave them in the comment i'm more than happy to help and thank you guys so much for the love stay blessed stay positive oh and come to the live stream too whenever you have a chance we do turn up we do get lit i'm trying to be a better point guard it's my first year playing point guard competitively so come check it out see some of my struggles i normally play lock so it's my first time playing point guard let's get it man it's fun i love the game hopefully they fix the server soon and we're gonna get out a lot of great content for everybody i got a my build video coming out it's gonna be crazy let's go Thank you for the support in STG. Let's go.